guys welcome back to my channel today I have a cosmetic haul from the Dollar Tree I bought tons of lipsticks a little bit of eyeshadows is more most of them are lipsticks and a little bit of nail polishes so the first items that I'm gonna start off with will be the Christmas items I found this Christmas countdown chalkboard um, it, I thought it was it will be nice for me to just write down the the days that are left I also found some tall socks, Christmas socks, knee-high socks, and this one is the green with silver white, polka dots. I got this cute <laughs> Santa Claus going down the chimney, and this cute penguin riding on the snowboard. So this is a knee-high socks. I just thought it was really, really cute. And then I saw this um, shower cap by April Bath and Shower shower cap in another haul, and I was, I really, really liked the quality of this shower cap. So I'm, and I'm gonna open one. This one I got the leopard one, the zebra. And I got this colorful one. This is my favorite one. It has different colors. And I'm going to open this to show you guys the quality of this shower caps, which is really, really good. Um, so it's this silky material on the outside. And then it has this plastic thing on the inside. And I think it's, it works great because this one will like... The plastic on these will prevent your water going inside to your hair. So, and it's pretty big too. As you can see, it fits me very well. So, I was so excited to find this, especially to find the three different um, styles. Next item that I bought is this scotch tape, and I'm gonna use this to. Um, put it on my tape dispenser. My dad gave me this tape dispenser, which is really a clear one. And I've never, I haven't used it. I've been having this for like a whole year, and this is my first time ever buying tape. I never really use tape, but then, this is gonna be my last time buying the 3D white because I read reviews how um, 3D or Crest is going to discontinue doing this toothpaste or is going to discontinue adding the little flakes inside, inside the toothpaste because according to a review, the, the, to, the little flakes in the, on the toothpaste is plastic um, and they've been finding those plastics inside your gum so I'm not going to buy this. This is my third box that I bought and this is going to be the last one. I, sadly, but yes, this is going to be my last 3D Crest White toothpaste. I also found the Glade Maple Pumpkin, the, the scent glass holder. And this one, it, you just have to peel off the foil from the refill and it should last for 30 days. So hopefully this lasts for 30 days. I bought one for November and then I bought December and then if I need an extra one for like next year. So I bought three in total, three of them. I also found this um, booklet. It's a notebook with 50 sheets and it has a heart shape. It's really pretty. Um, I figured that I'm gonna use this to write down all the names of the lipsticks that I have because whenever I do go to to the Dollar Tree sometimes I struggle and I can't figure out which are the lipsticks that I already have so I think by writing all the items here the name of the lipsticks I will be able to go to Dollar Tree and shop for the ones that I don't have I found this this elf light beige all over all over stick cover stick and this one says here that is good too um, treat under eyes blemishes and skin redness um if you guys want to see if it worked under my eyes please check out my other video it will be under the swatches 
and review up and and this is the makeup that I just finished recording this review um, and this is the end of results of putting this on under my eyes and on my problem areas so if you guys can go to the other video and check that out and then I also found Goody Auschla's hair hair ties or hair bands and this is the first one that I got this one comes with three this one is the glitter one the navy blue one and this gray one so it comes three in a pack I found this Goody Classic um, how do you call this barrette it's a clip in gold and then I got this one in silver the nail polishes that I found are the Milani I know I've seen this for a while already but I haven't had the chance to purchase them because I don't need any more nail polishes but oh well too bad I got this Milani um, high speed fast dry one coat formula like a white color I purchased this yellow one green one and this brown nature color brown color I also found NYC New Color um, eyeshadows and these are pretty cool because it tells you where to apply the eyelid, the crease, the, how to contour So, and it has a little drawing on the back which shows you instructions of where to apply them so I thought it was pretty cool this one is the Lexington's Look Luxury and then this one is the Union Square, which is almost kind of the same color. Um, so I decided to just buy two. Because those are the only ones they had. So I'm sure if they would have more, I would be buying all of them. I also found this e.l.f. Uh, French Lace Creamy and Pigmented Rich Eye Color. And it's a jumbo eyeshadow stick. And I'm going to open this and show you guys a swatch. Okay, this is how it looks. And then, this is for the eyes, so... So it's pretty glossy and... This is a color, so it, it doesn't have like a, a lot of color at all. So it's just a neutral. I also found um, NYC lipstick. And I was so excited to find all these lipsticks. A while back, before I started shopping at Dollar Tree, I wasn't a big fan of lipstick at all. I wasn't a really big fan of makeup at all. But since I found these items, great items, at Dollar Tree, I just, ever since I started shopping at Dollar Tree, I just got into lipsticks. And now, <laughs> I'm so obsessed with them. So I'm going to show you guys this color here. This one is called Flirty. And this is the way it looks. This is the Flirty. And I'll swatch this in another day because then this video is going to be super long. A caramel. 401 Caramel. It's like a brown color. So brandy Sparkle. Sugar Plum. I know most of them they kind of look the same but hopefully they don't swatch the same. And I think that's the only four lipsticks that I got from NYC of this kind. I thought I had 
much more but I guess not so these are the three ones that I have they look super super cute pretty pretty colors I love them so much and then I got other ones this is a glossy lip balm it leaves your lipsticks your lips so smooth and this is the first one this is the car caramel apple and it has a little apple this one is the apple blueberry and this is like a pinkish color it also has an apple design jump into the bandwagon of the LA color lip uh, lipsticks and I really really like my favorite out of all of them is Cho Shine because it's like a brown color And I'm opening all of them because I'm going to use all of them. This is the Natural Shine. This is the one that I always wear every day. Almost every day. Bright pink. And it is a bright pink. Pink Frost. I couldn't open it. This is a Pink Frost. This is the Nectarine. Which is a pretty color oh my god i can't open this tell me this is gonna work this is not working this is a nectarine color and it doesn't want to come out at all this is horrible i guess i can just take it out with a with a, a brush this is the color Coral Shin. This one is the Luscious Wine. Super dark. And this is Dusty Rose. This is Dusty Rose. Mouth Glaze. It's a dark color. This is the sorbet. Last but not least, this is um, the satin one. So it's really, really pretty. All of them are absolutely pretty. Um, I can't wait to try them on. I Like I said, I don't really use... Ever since I started going to Dollar Tree, I've been buying a lot of lipsticks and I'm so excited because I, I was never obsessed with lipsticks until I found the Dollar Tree. And if you can buy a lot for one dollar, it's just great. And these are all the colors that I have for the LA colors. I'm just really disappointed that the Nectarine wasn't working. So I'm just so excited to try this. And then this is the ones that I got for NYC. They're really, really pretty. So yes guys, I think that's all the items that I bought at the Dollar Tree. Please check out my other videos where I do a review of the Elf's All Over Cover Stick. Um, so, that, so that way you guys can get a closer inside if it worked or not on the redness and blemishes. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye bye!